Good evening my lovelies, happy Friday. I hope you've all had an amazing week and ready to start the weekend. Today has dragged, like really dragged. This week has flown by but then today has just dragged and I think it's because I've got a super duper exciting weekend with baby boy. As you can see the background is a little bit of a mess going on because I'm packing a suitcase. Right? Dramatic because um, I'm staying at Baby Boys for two nights. Overnight bag just wasn't enough. We needed double the size. So I filled that little suitcase and I've still got stuff. I'm like bringing options. Like there's not just two outfits in there. There's options. I'm just so dramatic in everything that I do. I just can't help it. Back to vlogging. I feel like I had a week off from vlogging. I just did that one video. Even though like I only vlog like two days a week but... I've had some really, really nice messages over on Instagram. Thank you so much. Like, it actually means the world that people actually even watch my videos. I just film myself doing my everyday thing. Like, I don't understand what, why anybody even watches it. What I wanted from my channel was to uplift people and make people feel better. I want to help you feel more confident and happier. Um, and by the messages that I've had, that's exactly what I'm doing. And like, I'm just so proud and happy that that's the, the way my channel's going because that's exactly what I want. I want you to come here, I want you to feel uplifted, happy, I want you to feel like you can go out of that door and take on the world because we don't give a damn what anyone thinks, we strut out of that door and we take it on like a bull by the horns. <laughs> You live once, do everything to the best of your ability, do anything that makes you feel happy and that, my friends, is the speech that I do every morning in the mirror. <laughs> but yeah, me and baby boy, we've got a super duper exciting weekend. So we both don't like roller coasters. So of course tomorrow we're going to Alton Towers, woohoo! So another thing that I really, really love to do is to, as I've mentioned before, push myself out of my comfort zone and do things that make me feel uncomfortable. Face your fears. So we really, really don't like roller coasters, so we're a little bit nervy. But another fear that I'm facing tomorrow is vlogging in front of First of all, baby boy, and second of all, a person. Like, normally I'm on my own. Like, actually being in front of someone and talking to a camera, I'm nervous. But yeah, so dead excited. Gonna try and get as much footage as possible. Oh, wish me luck. <laughs> I'm just packing my suitcase, my little suitcase, my little two day trip to Costanel Baby Boys. Yeah, I hope you're having an amazing day, and I will speak to you very, very soon. Good morning, my loves. So, um, me and baby boy are just getting ready to go to Alton Towers. Um, so I've just done a little makeup, he's doing stairs, making our little dinners. He's so cute. I'm just gonna have some breakfast and stuff before we go. We're gonna set off about half seven. I was a little bit nervous, so nervous. I'm trying to decide what to wear now because the weather is not looking as sensational as I thought it might. So you might go for either shorts or jeans. No asking if I feel to a bit of vlogging. <laughs> they weren't even switched on. So we're just setting off now to um, Alton Towers. I'm scared. I'm terrified. Cups, you'll catch me on Postman Park. <laughs> on a scale of one to ten, how nervous are you? Uh, for oblivion, easy a nine. <laughs> oh, some wigs going everywhere. Your wig? Can we go in that one, please? <laughs> It was scary. Like. It's the bits where you come out of your seat a little bit that yeah. scare the crap out like, of me. I didn't think there was going to be a massive drop, but it, there was a massive drop. Nah, I'm too big for this right He's got his hand in front of my face. <laughs> well, look at the state of that. That's great, that. How oh, bad is that? That's brilliant, man. That's the worst thing I've ever seen. That's the best photo I've ever seen. <laughs> what do you want me to say? 
<laughs> What's the name of this one we're going to? Smilo. Yeah. This is us heading to the Smilo. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh no. Oh. I'm smiling about nothing there, I'll be oh, honest. Definitely not. Baby. Oh, she's had a beer. <laughs> What's been your favourite ride so far? Yeah, uh, the Smilo. <laughs> Do it again. I think so. And which one are we going on next? Um, what else? Did they do one that's got like like water rapids? Like log flume. Your log flume. Maybe. Should we try that one? Yeah, we'll do that one. Okay. We'll get, might get a bit wet. It's alright. So we've completed most of the rides on this park at this point. We've done Nemesis, yeah. Oblivion, what Galactica. was that, Galactica. Uh, we've done all the big ones. We've completed all the big ones. So now we're just gonna go on some of the little ones, the little rubber, rubber dinghies. It's not yeah. called rubber dinghies, I keep calling it that. Log flume. It's not even called the log flume, <laughs> but it's kind of like the log flume. Uh, we did, however, forget our ponchos. So we could be absolutely piss wet through by the end of it. But we shall see. So, so far, obviously we've done these big rides. Yeah. Right, do you still feel like you're scared of roller coasters? Because I genuinely think I've gotten over my fear. The like, minute or two before you get on where I'm scared the most. And then once I've done it, I'm all right. So. I feel like I was terrified. And now, like we've faced our fears, this is exactly yeah, why we did really this. Well. We're doing really, really, so really well. <laughs> Your kid, that. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Peace, yo. Whoa. What's it? Fast, fast, is anything? Whoa. Oh, we're back with you, mate. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Why do you just look cool as a <laughs> cool as a cucumber at all? Probably one of the best. No, ever. it's not. Look at that. <laughs> You're trying to make it go faster, there. You've done very well on all these four ones. Oh yeah. 
No, that's not too bad. Well, we were on this one, the two of us. YOLO, innit? Why are we so far apart? We're like, we don't even like each other. <laughs> Sunday. I hope you've all had an amazing week, an amazing weekend. I hope you're having a lovely day, whatever day you're watching this. So I just thought I'd just come and just chat to you. I've nipped home to like get some stuff and whatever, but me and Baby Boy are having a lovely weekend. This morning we got up and we went to the gym, then we came back, we had something to eat, and now I've just, like I said, come home um, just to grab some more bits, and yeah, we're gonna go for some food tonight so I'll show you what I have there I'm really really excited for that but yeah just a little chilled Sunday very different to my usual routine we're switching up a bit sisters and I really really like it got to keep that routine fresh you've got to change it up but yeah as for Alton Towers absolutely love that really really did go just to face my fears and obviously baby boy is the same he doesn't like roller coasters but for me it was more of a like a mental challenge for both of us it was a mental challenge and um, as much as we knew it was going to be fun i think that we really wanted to do it just to prove to ourselves that you can do stuff that you're scared of you can push yourself out your comfort zone i think it's really really good to do things that that do scare you or that make you feel uncomfortable it makes us grow as people and you look back, like I look back at the person I was six months ago who wouldn't do half the things that I do now and that's what I want for you guys, I want you guys to to watch me and feel inspired to push yourself, push yourself out of the routine that you're in if you're stuck in a rut, if you're unhappy. Life is just so important, we have one life and you've got to make the most of every single day. Have a bad day, it's fine. You wake up tomorrow and you start again. I heard this once and it was, if you have a bunch of seven roses and one of them died, would you throw them all away? No, you'd keep the six. So keep that in your mind. If you're having a bad day, don't worry about it. Sometimes we do and it's not the end of the world. You can try and pull yourself out of that bad mood or bad state that you're in on that particular day or you can write it off chill out, have some time on your own, read a book or watch some YouTube or listen to some music, get some sleep, have a healthy meal, go to the gym, go for a walk, anything and then wake up the day after and treat it as a brand new day. Whether it's middle of the week or at the weekend, treat it as a brand new day. You're going to start afresh, wipe the slate clean and you're going to feel fantastic. So yeah, that's my little update. I'm gonna go back to baby boys now and just chill for a little bit this afternoon. And then, yeah, I'll speak to you very soon. Hello, my loves. Happy Wednesday. I didn't end the vlog, so I'm just here to end the vlog. It is Wednesday now. I have just got back from the gym, so do excuse this. This hairdo has been in since um, yesterday and I slept like this and then I went to the gym like this. So do you know what? I'm not bothered. Look, have I put my finger in a plug socket this morning? Anyway, um, just a couple of things to update you on. I put the lottery on last night because, let me tell you why, for two days in a row now, I've had two double yolks in my eggs. So when I've cracked my eggs, there's been two yolks in and I thought that was good luck. And then I had a little spider on my desk at work yesterday, so I had it crawl over my right hand because for, like, good luck in that. And then I put the lottery on. Right, I woke up this morning, I kid you not, right, I had an email. You know the email that you get and it's like, we have news about your ticket. And, and the email came through at like 20 to 1 this morning. And normally, like, it's a little bit later on, like the day after when the email, and I thought, oh, it must be urgent because they sent it through like straight away. So I didn't open the email, I went downstairs, I made a coffee, I thought, I'm going to have to compose myself here. So I got dressed, I did my makeup, and I went and sat down and I had a coffee and I took a few breathers and I was thinking, oh my God, I might not even have to go into work today because I am sat here and I'm a millionaire. These were the thoughts going through my mind. I was manifesting. I opened the email. It wasn't loading. I thought, oh, it's a sign. It's a sign. Oh my God, guys, I'm a millionaire. £1.90. But it's better than nothing. So we're looking 
always look on the bright side of life, right? I got one pound nine. I've got an extra one pound ninety more than what I did have. So we're all winners here. Yeah. What else? I feel like I had something else to tell you, but. <sighs> Do we like this little set from Bow and Tay? I really, really like it. I've got quite a few new gym outfits. I'm gonna film like a bit of a haul this weekend. Well, it's gonna be more of like a versus. So like, I've got Gymshark, uh, Alpha Lee, Bow and Tay, um, Rider Wear. Yeah, so I'm just gonna do a little bit of a, little bit of a haul, a little bit of a versus. We're gonna do squat proof. Are we squat proof? Like, I'm loving all the new little bits that I've got, so I can't wait to show you. So I'm going to do that this weekend, and I'm going to vlog, and yeah, oh, battery's dying, so better stop talking now. I really, really hope you enjoyed this vlog. This was my first vlog, like, actually vlogging in public, vlogging in front of baby boy. You met baby boy for the first time. I really, really hope you enjoyed it. Go and follow me over on Instagram. It's at jodeb underscore. If there's anything you want to see from me in the future, then please leave a comment down below and let me know. I hope that you and your families are all keeping safe and well and happy. I hope you've had an amazing week. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!